Ever wondered what each player does on a cricket field? Well, you're about to find out. Welcome to the fascinating world of cricket, a sport where strategy, precision, and teamwork come together in a grand spectacle. One of the essential aspects of cricket is understanding the field positions, each as unique and vital as the players who occupy them. Imagine a cricket field as an oval-shaped canvas, with the pitch at the center acting as the heart of the action. Now, visualize two sets of wickets at each end of this pitch and a boundary encircling the field, marking the outer limits of play. Just as in a painting, every stroke matters, and in cricket, each player's position on this canvas makes a significant impact on the game's outcome. It's a chessboard where each piece, each player, has a unique role and position. So, are you ready to decode these positions and roles? Let's dive in. In the spotlight of cricket are two key players, the batsman and the bowler. These roles are as different as night and day, yet they intertwine to create the thrilling game that is cricket. Let's start with the batsman. His goal is simple, to score as many runs as possible. He does this by hitting the ball bowled at him with his bat. But it's not just about swinging wildly, there's a finesse to it. A great batsman must be able to judge the speed and spin of the ball, deciding in a split second whether to defend, leave, or attack. Some batsmen prefer to play aggressively, aiming to hit the ball to the boundary for four or even six runs. Others might adopt a more defensive strategy, focusing on keeping their wicket safe and slowly accumulating runs. Now, let's flip to the bowler. The bowler's objective? To dismiss the batsman. He does this by delivering the ball in such a way that the batsman either misses and hits the wicket or hits the ball into the hands of a fielder. There are myriad ways to bowl, from fast and furious pace bowling to crafty spin bowling. Each style has its unique strategies and challenges. These contrasting roles of the batsman and the bowler create a captivating dance of strategy and skill, a back-and-forth battle that is the heart of cricket. Now that we've covered the main players, let's move on to the supporting cast, the fielders. Fielders, they are the unsung heroes of cricket. Often overlooked, these vigilant players are the backbone of the team, ready to make a game-changing catch or a lightning-fast throw at any given moment. Let's delve into their roles. Fielders are positioned strategically across the cricket field, each with a unique responsibility depending on their position. There are nine main fielding positions, each with a distinctive name. First up, we have the slips. Positioned right behind the batsman, the slips are responsible for catching any balls that the batsman edges off the bat. Then we have the gully, standing at an angle to the slips, ready to catch any balls that slip past them. Next is the point, a critical position located square of the wicket on the offside. The point fielder must be quick and agile, ready to stop the ball and prevent runs. Similarly, the cover, standing a little ahead of point but slightly closer to the batsman, is a crucial position, especially against a batsman who loves playing offside shots. The mid-off and mid-on fielders stand close to the bowler, one on the offside and one on the leg side. These fielders play a significant role in stopping straight drives from the batsman, preventing easy runs. On the leg side, we have the square leg, positioned square of the wicket. They're primarily responsible for stopping runs and catching short leg side shots. Lastly, we have the fine leg, located behind square on the leg side, crucial for catching any balls that the batsman flicks off his pads. Each of these positions plays a critical role in the team's strategy. The placement of fielders is a chess game in itself, constantly changing based on the batsman's style, the bowler's tactics, and the game's context. Fielders are crucial in making or breaking a game. Their quick reflexes, strategic placement, and unwavering focus can turn the tide of a match. But there's one more player we need to discuss, the wicketkeeper. Last but not least, the wicketkeeper, the guardian of the stumps. With quick reflexes and razor-sharp focus, the wicketkeeper is a crucial player in the game of cricket. Positioned behind the stumps, they are the only player permitted to wear gloves and leg pads on the field. Their role? Exceptionally multifaceted. They are the primary catcher of the ball, especially when the batsman misses or edges the ball, but their responsibility doesn't end there. The wicketkeeper also plays a pivotal role in running out the batsman. How, you ask? Well, when a batsman steps out of their crease, 
it's the wicketkeeper's job to stump them out. This requires lightning-fast reflexes and a keen eye. Moreover, they often serve as the fielding captain, guiding the fielders and setting the field. They're the eyes and ears of the team on the field. The wicketkeeper is the backbone of the fielding side, always alert and ready for action. So, we've covered the main roles and positions on a cricket field. Now, let's take a moment to wrap it all up and connect the dots. We started by understanding the cricket field positions, which are as varied and strategically placed as the stars in the night sky. From the infield to the outfield, each position plays a pivotal role in the game. They're the backbone of the team's defense, ready to catch the ball and prevent the opposing team from scoring runs. Then, we dove into the roles of the batsman and the bowler. The batsman, an artist of precision and timing, who uses his skills to score runs. The bowler, a master of spin and speed, whose main objective is to outwit the batsman and get him out. This duel between the batsman and bowler is the heart of the cricket game, a thrilling spectacle of strategy and skill. We explored the role of the fielders, the unsung heroes who back up the bowler, ready to catch or stop the ball to prevent runs. Remember, a great catch or a swift run out can turn the tide of a match. Finally, we highlighted the wicket keeper, the guardian of the stumps, always alert and ready to catch the ball, a vital link between the bowler and the fielders. Remember, cricket is not just a game of hitting a ball, it's a game of strategy, where every player and every position counts. Thanks for tuning in and see you on the next Cricket 101 series.